1936 Berlin Olympics, Hitler's Olympics, Germany's showcase, where the Nazis would demonstrate Aryan superiority. Most people remember how Jesse Owens exploded that myth. But many have forgotten how nine young men from the northwestern corner of the United States overcame tremendous difficulties to win a gold medal in the establishment sport of crew. I was eight years old in 1936, and I remember the excitement about their winning in Germany and that winning the Olympics, and uh, it was very exciting for Seattle. Rowing is an enormously hard thing to do at that level, and they endured the pain and the cold and the harsh realities of rowing and persevered through it. It's different than other sports. You are really uniquely together. It's that bonding that takes place and it lasts for the rest of your life. My teammates in college are my closest friends today. There's a bond that gets made you know, at six o'clock in the morning when it's pitch black out and it's pouring down rain and it's 35 degrees. So after you've been here for four years, you, they really become your brothers. I think it's really hard actually to learn about these nine young men from 1936 and, and not be inspired by their raw spirit. I think a lot of us in our families can understand what America was like, the United States was like in, those, in that era. Lots of our families went through the Depression and built up to the Second World War. We understand that. 1936 story is an extraordinary story, and that's what's happening here. It touches on kind of the intangibles of life, pushing through pain for this small chance at victory. It's a real story about real things that we as humans value very highly. Trust, believing in yourself, beating the odds, all of those things that we really love as people. Just be this group of guys that just kind of came out of nowhere, out of Seattle, out of the Seattle area, out of the Washington area, at a time when we still were seen as like, you know, being from the frontier. The story of the boys and kind of um, everything that they were um, and how humble they were compared to what the Nazis had in the 30s, I mean, I'm sure it looked very, very different. And being able to have a victory on such a huge um, international level, I think it resonates with a lot of people because it gives us hope and it gives us kind of this foundation that essentially believes that anything is possible if we're able to set our mind to it. I think the story resonates with so many people because it reminds us that we're capable of overcoming great adversity. And most of all, it reminds us that our greatest power is when we pull together. In some ways, it's sort of a metaphor for the American people. The story resonates because it takes people back to a time when people were able to pull together and get great things done.